Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the shop once again. Today we have some good news finally for all of you out there that own a Ford vehicle with a 5.4 liter, three valve, Triton Nightmare engine under the hood. Now as you all know probably by now there's a lot of inherent design flaws within this engine. I mean heck, I basically built this channel on that engine and all the repairs it needs. But about 80% of them all relate back to low oil pressure and volume issues causing accelerated wear, knocking issues, VCT error issues. There's a lot of issues within this engine and a lot of them relate back to the oil pressure and volume just being inadequate to run everything. Okay. Now up until now there has not been a high volume pump available for this engine because there's clearances in there that are so tight it's almost impossible to make a higher volume pump. But Melling did it, okay? They came out with the Melling M340 HV and the M360 HV, and these offer 20% higher volume over a stock oil pump. And this is gonna help you know, make the engine last a lot longer. It's gonna help correct you know, clearance issues that within the engine that are getting bigger as time goes on. You can kind of mask them by providing that higher volume. And also, it can correct a lot of VCT errors, which I'm sure a lot of you out there have been watching my videos on them. And they, again, they all relate back to oil pressure because that's how they are ran. Okay, so there's a lot of different components within this engine that rely on oil pressure and good volume. Real quick, I want to give you a little backstory on this high volume pump. Now, I first learned about it back in November of 2016 at the SEMA show in Las Vegas. There I talked with the Melling rep directly about all the oil pressure and volume issues that are so common within the 543 valve engines. And I said, why is there no high volume pumps out there available for this engine? We desperately need a high volume pump for all these issues. And he pulled me to the side and he said they are developing a high volume pump for this engine. It's very tight in there, but they were able to squeeze out another 20% more volume from a stock bolt-in pump and make it work, okay? And he said, you just can't say anything about it until it's officially released and done with R&D and testing, okay? So they had all of 2017 to do their R&D, their testing, and of course, build up enough stock to officially announce it, and they did in November of 2017. Now, the problem with that is that that's great. It's available, there's enough stock, it's done, it's ready for the market. You can't find it anywhere. There's no information on the web. You can't find places that are selling it. You wouldn't even know about it unless you contacted Melling directly, okay? So what I did is I worked with a company, a part seller on Amazon to make them, well, to ask them to start stocking this pump so it's available for sale because no one has it for sale. And this is gonna be a great, great thing, a great upgrade to have in your 543 valve engine. Now, I recently put on an M360 HV, which is big brother to this one right here, the higher pressure version, and I put in an 04 F150 with 300,000 miles on it. Yeah, it's still going. He came in for a full timing set, and of course, I put on the new high volume pump, and I could not believe how accurate and steady the VCT system was in that engine. It, that just sold me right there on these new high volume pumps that they're really needed in just about every one of these engines. Now let's go over to the bench real quick and I'll talk about the differences between the old pumps and the new high volume pumps so you have a better understanding on the bench here. Let's take a second to look at the M340 and the M360 that you guys are so used to hearing about. Now there's a lot of misinformation about these pumps out there and I wanna clarify that right now real quick. Now the M340 is a stock replacement oil pump from Melling for this engine so it has stock volume and stock pressure, 60 PSI. Whereas the M360 is stock volume, but high pressure, so it's 80 PSI relief spring in here, okay? Now they both incorporate design improvements over the factory Ford pump, including the cast iron backing plate back here. Now the Ford pump had an aluminum backing plate that used to deflect under load at higher RPMs and just bleed out all kinds of oil off the backside. There's a couple of videos online about it and it, just to show how bad it is. These both incorporate that. So the only difference between these two is the relief spring pressure. 
And here's a close-up of the new high-volume pump. You can see it's a little bit different color, and of course it's thicker because they got to have the taller gears inside of here to get the extra volume out of it. Now, the M340 HV and the M360 HV carry over the same spring pressure relief specs. So the 340 HV has 60 PSI stock, and then the M360 HV has an 80 PSI release spring in it. Both of them are 20% higher volume, and they incorporate all the other design improvements, including the cast iron backing plate. So just to let you guys know, this pump is out there, and if you open up the front of your 543 valve for any reason, you want to pop one of these in there. You'll be glad you did. I'll see you guys next time.